Hello YouTube, Kyle Kupchak, vocalist of CZYK, an upcoming band you should check out, link in the description. We have a surprising release today, Blood and Water, Memphis Mayfire, brand new single, you'd love to see it. Uh, so, I'll be honest with you, ever since Unconditional, I kind of fell off with Memphis Mayfire. I mean, there was a few songs off of the slide of hold that I enjoyed, but once it came to Broken, I... I gave up. I listened to like two songs and was like, yeah, that was a fun run. I'll just listen to their old stuff now. Be one of those douchebag fans. But from what I've seen, this song is actually really fucking good. So I'm going to take everybody's word for it and get that shit going. So without further ado, I'm excited to see where Memphis Mayfire went and how hard they're coming back. Future Kyle. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a fun riff. I really like that. That, that's about the snipe fire right there. Hell yeah. Oh, halftime, baby. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that was a cool line to finish it off. And then back to that main riff. I heard, I hear extra guitar. Something's about to happen. First breakout question mark? Oh, come on! Oh, God. They're back, bro. <laughs> Dude, this chorus is so catchy. I mean, they've always had catch choruses, but they, um... Breakdown, baby! Oh! They just kicked it back to 2013. Jesus. Oh my god. Maddie, yes. That should have been longer. <laughs> that made me really sad, actually. <laughs> oh, they changed it up.
Well, there you fucking have it. Blood and water, Memphis Bayfire. Yo. <laughs> that was pretty fucking sick. So, like, for Memphis Mayfire, I don't know. It's just so many of their songs have the exact same sound. Like, even when it comes to the rift, this one hit different, though. I don't know why, but it sounded really fucking sick. So, I mean, let's just get into it. Oh, I actually know. Before we get into it, why, why was that breakdown so short? Like, he did the whatever scream, and it cut off, and then it went to the ambient thing. I'm like, that transition could have been better. That could have went a little bit longer, and, like, it could have, like, de-escalated down into the uh the last chorus or they could have just ended it with that scream and it would have been done and people would have been like Yo! but i don't know why they had another chorus but they're the musicians not me oh well, i'm trying to be a musician anyway i'm a wannabe anyways so vocals i've always been a huge fan of maddie mullen's vocals um, even his side project with Cody Quinstad from Wage War, um, Hillian 65 or something. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's what the project's called, but their country song, I mean, both Cody and Maddie in the same track was fucking sick and just anything Maddie Mullins, he does a great job. His cleans and screams are so clean <laughs> that like it like it, you could almost say that it's a really generic voice but at the same time when you hear it you know it's maddie mullins it's it, it's a fucking weird process but um overall lyrics for memphis mayfire the lyrics weren't as cringy as i expected because usually it's pretty interesting <laughs> for that um, but they actually did a pretty good job with the lyrics and obviously the melody. Whew. That chorus was so good. Um, honestly, I feel like the guitars, the guitarist has the, um, MVP for, uh, this video just cause I swear to God, like there was so many different noises going on in my ears and it was all guitar shit. They, they, they almost had like modern metal core guitar playing while keeping their core sound and i know i'm gonna get hate for that but yeah <laughs> um just overall that main riff was really cool i thought that was really good and then when i came to the breakdown solid as fuck everything just this whole song solid as fuck okay and then the drums, I have no complaints. You kept the song moving. Um, I really liked the halftime and the chorus. And then in that last chorus, um, I'm trying to uh, figure out the word. But, you know, the double bass was going faster and whatnot. It just it, it boosted the energy for that last chorus. And honestly, I think it would have been impact more impactful if they switched that last chorus with the other two and then have that half time in the last chorus i think that would have made it like oh, God damn. instead of the uh two half times and then the other one i don't know but overall great fucking video great song i'll definitely be listening to it a lot more and i'll definitely be looking out for memphis mayfire releases as should you so I'm going to leave this reaction here. If you haven't, make sure to like, dislike, subscribe, hate me, whatever you want to do. I'm the vocalist of a metal band called CZYK. Make sure to check us out down in the description. If you want something heavy metal, listen to our song The Void or Cracked. If you want something depressing and sad, listen to our song Everlasting Nightmare. If you want something rock, listen to our songs All I Know or Give It Time. That's all I got for you.